Steven Twitch boss cause of death has officially been ruled out as a suicide according to Los Angeles County Medical Examiner Coroner. In a statement to People County of officials confirmed that the 40-year-old professional dancer died of a self-inflicted gunshot wound to the head. His death occurred on Tuesday, December 13, 2022 at a motel in the Encino area of Los Angeles. According to the Los Angeles County Medical Examiner Coroner, the case is now closed according to page 6 police discovered boss body in a Los Angeles hotel room after his wife Allison Holker practically reported that he had left home without his car which was unlike him. Boss wife Allison announced the death of the late beloved dancer in a heartbreaking statement. It is with the heaviest of hearts that I have to share my husband. Steven has left us, she had said, I am certain there won't be a day that goes by that won't honor his memory. In addition to Allison, Boss is survived by children Zaya 3, Maddox 6 and Wesley 14. Friends and colleagues took to social media to express their grief and honor Twitch, including Alan DeGeneres, Justin Timberlake, Channing Tatum, Jennifer Lopez amongst others. Boss rose to fame as a contestant on MTV's The Way Drops and Project before becoming a runner-up on Star Search. He later competed on So You Think You Can Dance in 2008, ending season 4 as a runner-up and later returning as an all-star via people. In 2014, he joined the Ellen DeGeneres show as a guest DJ and eventually became a permanent fixture on the series. He later became co-executive producer in 2020 and as the show ended, he became a judge on So You Think You Can Dance when it returned in 2022. So this is it. See you guys in the next video.